Welcome to EA Sports live coverage of the Euro League. The game, of course, under floodlights this evening. So without further ado, we're off to the stadium. Here's your commentary team, Martin Tyler and Alan Smith. Welcome to you. I'm Martin Tyler. Alan Smith is with me. We are set now to describe Euro League action for you. Yeah, it's a high level of uh, competition, this, and uh, you have to be consistent. Line up for the home side. This is the away team line up. Timmy Simons, the stories in the papers this week have been about possibly him announcing his retirement, Alan. What do you make of that? Well, it's his decision. I mean, you are a long time retired and you don't want to make a premature judgment, but uh, he hasn't been in the best of form recently. Let's have a look at the referee today. It's Heiner Schnitty. The waiting is over. The game is off and running, and so are the players. Well, we've got an injured player now, and the referee has called a halt. The referee's just dropped the ball, and they're going to give it back to the other team after that substitution. Got the ball back through a very good interception. A touch off the player and out. Well, the throw is intercepted. Well, that's widened the game here, and they've got it to the wide man well. Timmy Simons. Maybe the cross. Goal news from Villarreal. It's a goal for Villarreal. It's been scored by Giovanni Dos Santos. He beat the offside trap and rounded the keeper who came out to the edge of the area to intercept. Six minutes played, 1-0. Cheers, Alan. He's going to let too much go, certainly not in the early minutes. He's given the free kick. Cards out here. Referee not wasting any time early in the match. He's going to try and impose his law and order. Yeah, I think he's just trying to get his point across to the players. He's not going to accept any nonsense. He's maybe expecting a, a passionate, uh, hotly contested match, but uh, he's going to be in charge. Now they can use some wit. That's a good pass. Sliding in for that challenge. been a penalty involving the Stade Gialon, Alan McAnally. It's a penalty for Leon. A slight delay as the ref clears the defenders. Up he steps. Oh, he went for massive power off the crossbar and blasted over. 11 minutes played, it remains nil-nil. Thank you very much, Alan. Oh, it's out of play, off the player. Goal news from Villarreal. It's a goal for the visitors. 14 minutes played. And here's the shot. Well, sometimes we don't give defenders enough credit, but I think they were responsible for the uh, margin of that miss. Yeah, even though they couldn't get the foot on the ball, their presence was enough to put the player off. 
Leo Rafailov. Could be dangerous. No great challenge to our goalkeeper here to deal with that shot from long range. Silva. Well, let's pause for a moment to let in Alan McAnally here with some goal news. It's a goal for the visitors. 17 minutes played, 1-0. Cheers, Alan. Vesutte. Strong tackle to break up the play. Well, that slide tackle couldn't stop him. Leo Rafailov. And that will be a corner. Replay on that yellow card. Mistimed it. I think it was an honest attempt at the ball. Uh, the referee hasn't forgotten what he saw earlier. He's come back and the card's coming out for the culprit. Yeah, no surprise there. It was a pretty poor challenge and rightly booked. In with the chance. Here's the shot and it's just wide of the target. Nimble footwork from the player there as the opponent came in on the slide. Silva, good position. They've worked this attack very well into a quite a dangerous position now. In quickly. They've set it up well for the cross. Well, he will say that the ball should have come quicker. He's offside. Well, he's beaten his man. Brilliant technique in the tackle. It'll be a throw. No nonsense clearance from the defender. a good chance now to cross it's one back Simons Leo Rafailov throw in now Silva. And that tackle has got him the ball. He has to clear it. Now that's a throw. Timmy Simons. Patience is okay, but you've got to have some penetration at the end of it. Well, they're in a good position here. He can cross it now, and the cross coming in. Well defended here from a good cross. Made the challenge well. Leo Rafailov. Simons. Well, everyone knows he's the playmaker, so if you're given the ball by him, you've got to give it back to him, and that's what they've done. It's a chance to go left. He's looking left, and that's where the help is arriving. And the defenders come in well here. Timed his uh, approach and got the ball. And there's a teammate free in the middle here. He committed himself here. There wasn't much cover. But he got the ball, the defender, in the wide position.
Simons. And he's going on beyond the slide tackle. Would have been a crunching tackle if he'd felt it, but he got out of the way of it. Keeps it going. Here's the chance. And that will be a corner. be a, a throw here Engels Seamont and this is going to be a throw Leo Rafailov it's a chance for the wide man to make some progress here that's good support play from his teammates got to be very good defending to get in the way of that shot. Now that will be a corner. Whipped out wide. Good ball to stretch the opposition. That's a fantastic clearance. He rose to the occasion and saved the day. Made the challenge well. Referee's pointed for a free kick here. Good forward play from them. And that's given away possession. In with the chance. Great defending by the player. Rafailov. Player slid in at him. Somehow he got out of the way. And they're still going backwards. Ball. What a chance here. Off the post. It's looking good, this move. It's a chance. Got to be. And the goalkeeper has done well to stop that one. It will be a corner. So it's half time and we're still waiting for that first goal. Easy on the eye this first half with two teams trying to go about it the right way. And certainly in terms of efforts at goal, they are. Change of ends. The second half is underway. Victor Vasquez. Wonderful work with the ball then. Oh, in goes the cross. Attacking well here. That just bubbles through. Easy for the goalkeeper. to Vasquez. It's a poor touch and the possession's gone away. 
keep you right up to date during this match with what's going on elsewhere. And here's Alan McAnally. It's a goal for the home team. Played 2-1. Cheers, Alan. Throw in now. And in goes the cross. It's a good piece of defending to stop the supply into the centre. Tackle goes in. Leo Rafailov. Victor Vasquez. And here's the shot. Off the bar. Back into play. Into the face of the opposition. And he gets it back again, quickly. Keeps it going. That's where you want to try and get control in midfield, and they've got the ball. Superb defending by one of the most consistent players on the pitch. Goal news from Wolfsburg. It's a goal for the visitors. 60 minutes played, 2-1. Thank you very much, Alan. Possession in the midfield area. De Sutter. Leo Rafailov. Referee says play on. Now, it wasn't a good tackle, without any doubt, but the worst thing for supporters when you've got the ball is to hold up the play. Lamar. The shot's off. It's bounced back into play from the bar. In with a chance. Oh, that's what we've come to see. That's a brilliant goal. And he knew exactly where the keeper was there. He knew he didn't have to hit it particularly hard, you know. Well, let's take another look at the goal. Check on the aggregate scoreline here, 2-1. Bjorn Engels, Victor Vasquez, Leo Rafailov. It's gone out, clearly off that player. Vasquez. Timmy Simons. That's the way to win the ball back. Slipped his man. Here's the chance. Back out of the bar. Good forward play from them. It's good balance to avoid the sliding challenge. Now Kira. And 
becomes a challenge. Here's an update for you from Alan McAnally from the Bolin ground. It's the second goal for San Etienne. It's been scored by Mevlut Erdinch. A well-hit shot that came back off the far post and unfortunately for the keeper, hit him in the back of the head and went in. 71 minutes played, 2-2. Two -two. Thanks, Alan. Leo Rafailov. It's a great run over the slide tackle. Well, they've got the corner now to try and get themselves level. Hutter. And that is a super interception. And the shot's on. Well, it wasn't the best connection, was it? You've got to hit these uh, new footballs right in the middle, right on that sweet spot. Yeah, and he's normally quite reliable when it comes to striking the ball, but got that one a little bit wrong. Victor Vasquez. Oh, he's totally, totally done the defender. Penalty at San Siro, Alan McAnally. It's a penalty for Inter. He's put the ball down on the spot. Little check, out box the goalkeeper, drills it in the corner. 77 minutes played. And he goes for goal. It was an effort at goal, but not really worth the attempt. We should thank these supporters, Alan, for the atmosphere they've created for us to work with today. And their reward for that is seeing their team win. Yeah, and uh, quite rightly, they're celebrating that here. They can afford to relax. There's the ball in. It's a good headed clearance. Alan McAnally is our man watching elsewhere. Alan, what have you got to tell us? It's a third goal for Sevilla. Ten minutes remain. 3-1. Thank you very much, Alan. Alan McAnally, we had to just interrupt him there. I apologise for that. But he was telling us that Inter have scored. It's a goal from the penalty spot, making the score 2-1. Pass one defender. Here's the cross. De Soto! When he headed it, he thought he must have scored. Goalkeeper had another idea, though. Well, it was a brilliant stop, but I don't think he should have had a chance with that. The lad should have scored for me. Oh, he's been on the top of his game out here this afternoon, this keeper. I don't think he's going to get beaten. Where there's life, there's hope, but there's not much life in the game. Well, those defenders are going to be asked to head the ball. Quite a lot, I think. Plenty of aerial balls are going to be coming their way in the next few moments. Over to Gira. We've got eight more minutes of the 90. Got to be. Well, but for the goalkeeper, I think that would be that. He's kept the margin to one goal. Well, he's given them a chance late on in this match. And can they take it? the goal with his head. His goal! It's a brilliant header! And he had to get the old neck muscles working there to steer that one into the bottom right with his head. I don't have another look at this goal. of the aggregate score, 3-1. Victor Vasquez. And it's gone out, clearly off that player. Well, they've got the ball there and they want to restart the game. You can understand that with the throw on it goes. Leo Rafailov. The shot. He's got right underneath that. He went in well. And the header was at the goalkeeper and a straightforward save. Well, I think the keeper would have thought he'd been busier with that, but instead straightened his arms. That's 
Costa, clever pass. Lamar. Over to Gira. Dangerous moment. In with a chance. It's a goal. Keeper's got no chance because he's hit it so hard to his right. Well, they want to see this again, this goal. Four one on aggregate. Victor Vasquez and the player working hard to stay in possession. Sultan Gira. What a chance here. Takes the shot off. He's made the save. Here comes the referee, referee Heiner Schnitti, trying to intervene in this situation. Needs to intervene. It's yellow from the ref. Oh, without question. Leo Rafailov. That's the keeper's save, and he's kept the ball. It's all over. And there is the final whistle. Well, there it is. The referee has ended it. They are through in this cup game on aggregate. Yeah, well, the losers can have no complaints over 180 minutes. These boys were the better side. Well, there was really only one team in that game, and their fans will be travelling home delighted.